I got your text. I'm starting early. Do you want one? No, Ta. I was gonna knock round anyway. The kiss. <sighs> kiss. Things got a bit heated. They did. It was mutual, obviously. I'm holding my hands up. Thing is, I care about you so much. And we do have this this connection, but I'm with Daniel. And without sounding really naff, your friendship means the world to me. And it wasn't fair of me to kiss you back. It was selfish. I got a bit carried away. But more than anything, I really don't want to jeopardize our friendship. <coughs> well, you tell it straight is relief. <coughs> I mean, there's Karen pretending to be Crystal. I mean, how fake, how low can you go? Or maybe she thinks I haven't suffered enough. Or maybe she's just got a thing for uh, facial injuries. You know, there are some seriously weird people out there. You know, just hiding in plain sight. Just tune out. Focus on your recovery. It's the best thing you can do. Mm. You know, I saw Max yesterday. Don't worry, I'm not going to do the whole I said, he said thing. Long story short, Max had Crystal's phone. <laughs> I say Crystal's, but I mean yours, obviously, because you're Crystal, right? I'm so sorry. Well, your fun's over it. You got found out. No, I have hated lying. You were bored for it. When the real Crystal said that she... That she wasn't up for a long-distance relationship. That she didn't want to touch me with a barge pole. Why don't you just tell it like it is? OK, yeah. She didn't want to know. And, Ryan, you were in such a bad place. Yeah, well, I'm in a worse one now! I knew how much you liked her, and I couldn't bring myself to tell you that, so I just thought a text from Crystal ending things would help, but it just hit snowballed, and you messaged back. Get a message, Crystal! You were playing God with my feelings. You needed a friend to confide in. You needed someone to get you through. You are... You are twisted, you know that. You're twisted. OK. <laughs> well, even if I am, the connection was genuine. A genuine lie. I needed to hear from you as much as you needed to hear from Crystal. And I'm sorry. I am sorry, and you mean so much to me. Yeah, well, yeah, apart from the old fiancé factor. Yeah, you said. I mean, how long are you going to keep it going for? Were you, were you just going to like, text me little secret messages from your honeymoon? Yeah. I did it because I cared. And I know, that sounds crazy, but that is the truth. Uh, how can you even fight your corner? You know when a cat catches a bird, but it doesn't quite kill it? It just bats it around no, for a bit, no, playing no, with it. No, it wasn't yeah. like that. The feelings were real. The whole thing was one massive lie. <laughs> we mean nothing to each other. Do you understand? Do you understand? Get out now! Get out! if you can help me. I'm looking for a handsome gentleman with a very sweet tooth. <laughs> How are you? Mm, take it easy, mate. Cloud nine. But why do you put the kettle on? Because, you know, I have about 15 cups a day. Did you know? About what? Look, why don't you let me in and I'll make us that brew? Were you in on it? Did you know? About what, love? No. Days. Hey, are you all right? Hey. Yeah. Yeah, fine. Sorry, I'll, I'll make up the time. Is it Daniel? No. No, it sounds daft, but time of the month. Oh, that and everything you've been through. You and Ryan, oh, he's in a bad way. Did you take the sweets round? Yeah, I did, but he won't let me in. I phoned Carla. I told her she's got to get round there. He's drunk as a skunk. He's lashing out. He kept asking me if I knew. Did you know? Were you in on it? And then he just slammed the door in my face. He needs professional help, poor kid. Hey, but look, I've got to crack on, but you take your time. 
Hey, it's me. Look, I'm coming over, and I need you to hear me out. Okay? Please, hear me out. Oh! Uh, you got a moving speech for me? Hey, well, we need mood music. I can't stand that I've hurt you. Please, Ryan, I can't bear it. I'm the one that has to do the bearing days. Oh, Crystal, whatever your name is. I meant well. <laughs> That's all I've got. I meant well. Did you mean well when you destroyed my relationship with Alia? No. I was vile and entitled, but that's past tense. What's that saying? When somebody shows you who they are, believe them. The first time. The inside was rotten then, and it still is. I mean, great packaging. Look here, stunning. All your ugliness is on the inside. Yeah, well, that is what I'm afraid of. Mm. Did it spice it up a little bit for you and Daniel, did it? Mm. What? That's ridiculous. You're being ridiculous. Oh, I'm being ridiculous. Well, that's quite the insult coming from you. No, I didn't mean... You could never be ridiculous. You are brave and you're courageous and you... Blah, blah, blah. Lies, 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 lies. The feelings were real. The friendship is real. You made me fall in love with Crystal. And with you. Both unavailable. And I'm sorry. I am sorry, but it was just like this runaway train. You know what, when I lost Crystal, I thought, you know what, at least, at least I still had you. I just had this stupid gut feeling that we could be great together. In a parallel universe, maybe, but the timing, it's oh, not... don't flatter yourself, love. No, I, I used to, I used to envy Daniel. Now I just feel sorry for him marrying a shell. Mm. Okay. Mm. That make you feel good. Well, that's fine. Keep it coming, because I deserve it. Bet he doesn't know that we kiss, though, does he? Eh? Twice. Hmm? Nah, didn't think so. Two snogs on the runaway train. What are you doing? Well, I'm gonna go pull that emergency lever. Doesn't seem fair to keep him in the dark now, does it? <laughs> Jenny? Have you seen Daisy? We're supposed to be going for lunch, but she's not answering her phone. I, I've just seen her in the gardens, actually, but it won't surprise me she's gone to talk Ryan down. Ryan? Yeah. Between you and me, he's having some sort of crisis. Drunk in the middle of the day. Daniel! Just the guy I was looking for. He knows. Well, what's Daniel got to do with anything? I think I might have an idea. <laughs> you, you don't know the half of it, mate. I do. <laughs> She told me. Look, I know, you must be furious, but believe me, it was done with the best intentions. Cook, what exactly are we talking about here? Right, right, so your girlfriend's a liar, and what, you're, you're all right with that, are you? I think liar is a bit strong. It was misguided, but it came from a good place. OK, then, well, well, hey, if she can string me along, what other lies is she uh, capable of? Can we just... Just go to the back room. Do you really think that I'd build a life with her if I couldn't trust her? Do you think I would do that to Bertie? Could somebody please enlighten me? Ryan! Ryan, please. She's been messaging me! Pretending to be Crystal! Yeah, catfishing me this whole time! This whole time! <laughs> Leading me on. What? Yeah. Listen, if I were you, mate, I'd keep my eye on her. 